We are back with some more Post Malone music. So in today's video, we'll be checking out Buyer Beware by, of course, and Post Malone. Now, Buyer Beware, I have absolutely no idea what to even guess for this uh, for this song. Buyer Beware, like, what? Uh, I just, I don't even know. He's saying whoever is buying something. I don't know if he's the one that's buying or uh, maybe somebody else is the one that's buying. Uh, if I have to guess, I'm guessing that either he's the buyer or somebody else is the buyer and he's giving a warning to maybe himself or the other person uh, that just beware I'm, I'm guessing the subject is gonna be around love or something like that like beware buyer like if you're coming for my love you might get end up hurt or something like that I don't know I'm just making some random uh, assumptions or something you know I guess you can say but buyer beware uh, really really interesting it is a song that is two minutes and 53 seconds long uh, we do have three more songs after this one uh, to check out I know it's once again it's been a very very long time almost two months or something like that since he's uh, dropped this album but we're still here checking out the music uh, which is I don't know okay I know I'm supposed to do it like maybe right away or something like that uh, but look I just I want to enjoy my post Malone music slowly okay and not just take it all at once because this guy barely drops any music then we have to wait like another year or two years for him to like drop something else so I'm just taking my time with post Malone but let's just see what's gonna happen in this video but before we get into this video if you can hit that like subscribe button to keep up there with all the videos that'd be awesome without further ado let's just get right into this one Once again, really, really interesting vibe that we have been seeing from Post Malone, uh, especially on this album. I don't know how to really, like, I feel like half of the times his intro, his lyrics, especially in this album, has been really, really interesting. You know, sometimes it's not right straight at, like, what he is trying to say or what he's trying to get at. You know, it's like he's... I don't know if this is the correct term, but like beating around the bush, basically, you know, where he's just like saying these words, but he's not going straight at the topic at times. And I'm not saying that this is the song or in this song that he's doing that or anything like that, but I'm just saying in general, we've seen a lot of lyrics where it's kind of not direct, you know, like he's using, let's say, a lot of metaphors uh, or he's just using the, his words really, really different, I would like to say, uh, which is really, really interesting. But I absolutely love how majority of the songs do have a guitar, I believe, uh, and I absolutely love the guitar I absolutely love the drums as well uh, but this song is really really interesting I'm absolutely loving the music once again his voice you can see he's him using that gargle voice once again uh, with a couple of the words uh, which I really really like I do, I do like when he uses that but obviously again too much of something probably isn't good but in this so far it's been perfect uh, but let's just keep going on with this song Sorry, baby, I don't 
thing is, I really, I'm really interested to see what Post Malone's gonna go like do in the future, you know? Because a lot of his music, I feel like, again, is a lot of it is him pouring out his emotion. Is he gonna just continue pouring out his emotions? Uh, because I feel like this is like a phase that he's been through or gone through, maybe recently or maybe in the past years. Uh, but I feel like at some time he might switch up his music. I feel like you know, like he's gonna probably. Just talk about something different in general. Obviously, he'll still have these sad songs and stuff like that. He'll still talk about his emotions or how he's felt uh, at one point uh, at a time. But I feel like, you know, when life changes, like he has like a kid now, I'm pretty sure, and stuff like that. When life changes like that, I feel like your music might change as well. Uh, maybe it might be a lot more maybe love songs or something like that. Uh, I, I'm just really interested to see how Post Malone uh, is going to, I guess, navigate through his feelings now. Uh, especially on with his upcoming music, uh, possibly once again, like in a year, maybe two years. I have absolutely no idea. I'm, if I have to guess, I'm, I'm thinking he might take a year off and, and then post in like what 2025 or something like that. Uh, because he usually, I feel like he usually like takes a lot of like not a lot of time, but he takes like a year or two years uh, to drop an album and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, once again, really, really excited to see what what's up next for Post Malone, honestly. Uh, but I'm absolutely loving the music for this one, so let's just keep rolling. Alright, that was Buyer Beware from Post Malone. Now, I have to say, that song, once again, the lyrics were really, really interesting. Uh, and obviously, I absolutely love the music as well. I absolutely love that guitar that he usually, I would, say, or would like to say, has for majority of the songs on this album. Uh, he does have that guitar playing, uh, which I, if he does that on a tour, he's probably playing the guitar for every single song. <laughs> if he does a performance for this album, because a majority of the songs do have a guitar in it, so maybe he's playing the guitar for every single song. Uh, but I know that he usually obviously loves to jump around, do some dance moves, and have a fun time in general. Uh, so I don't think that he'll probably be just be sitting there and playing the guitar while singing all the songs. Uh, he's probably going to move around and do a lot more because that's just how Post Malone is. Even though I've never been to his concert, we've seen a couple of videos uh, where he loves to just once again dance, move around, walk around, jump around, whatever it may be. He's always just active, always smiling at times and uh, just enjoying the performances in general. Uh, and yeah, honestly, I absolutely love this song. I would absolutely love to see what's coming up next for his music. Uh, is it going to be something different? Is it just going to be, you know, because I feel like Post Malone's gone through like a a lot of different phases you know he kind of went through like that hip-hop phase then he kind of maybe went through like that rock phase and then that pop phase and I, I feel like currently we're kind of in that pop phase a little bit uh, but it's really really interesting how uh, Post Malone's music has just like went from this genre to this genre to that genre and then who knows what's up next uh, but I have absolutely have been enjoying this journey from Post Malone. Once again, we do have three more songs to check out from the uh, this album. Uh, but I absolutely enjoyed this song. So grading wise, I would definitely give that a green. I would definitely put it on my playlist. So comment down below how you guys thought about that song. And also comment down below what else you guys would like to react to. Now that was once again another amazing song from Post Malone. But if you check out some more music from him, then I suggest you watch this video right over here.